atupige makofi basi najua hamuoni lakini naweza nikawaambia kwamba tuna sign upande wa pili mikono imepewa hapo sasa kama national housing tumewapata wabia kama wadau kama hawa hawa ni wadau ambao tunafikiri kwamba itatusaidia kui challenge partnership yote tulio nayo tuna partnership ya mabenki 20 lakini ni sema nafikiri katika product zote 20 mabenki yote 20 tulio nayo benki iliyo wasoma na ikaelewa wa Tanzania vizuri properly ni absa mmewasoma mmetuelewa kwa hiyo nawapongezeni sana katika hilo. Sasa sisi National Housing labda tumekuja kivyetu vyetu safari lakini tumekuja tumewasoma vizuri wa Tanzania. Tuna miradi mingi tulishasema tumeamua kuwa wehu wa maendeleo. Miradi yetu mingi italenga sana soko la kati na chini kati. Hiyo ndio itakuwa key driver. Lakini soko la juu nao tutawapa vyao na soko la chini lakini sisi tutakuwa tunajestablish zaidi na kipa cha kati na chini kati. Tuna miradi ya Samia Housing Scheme. Ile ni miradi ambayo tunaenda kuijenga Tanzania nziba. Lakini focus kubwa iko Dar es Salaam na Dodoma na mikoani kwingine tutaenda based on demand. Nyumba za kawe tumezianza, hatujatoka hata juu ya msingi asilimia sabini zimesha uzwa. Lakini natuambia kwamba bei tulioenda iko sahihi. Kwa hiyo tunajitahidi kwamba tusiwe na nyumba ya 3 bedroom itakayozidi milioni mbili. Ndio lengo letu tunalojitahidi sasa hivi. Tunajitahidi kwamba nyumba zetu tutakazojenga ziwe katikati ya miji yetu yote ili watanzania wasipate tabu ya logistics ya transport na kumuvu. Tunafikiri ni gharama, tunafikiri haina quality ya maisha. Kwa hiyo sehemu ambayo tumejenga ni mbali kutoka CBD ya leo ambayo ni kilomita tisa kutoka CBD ya leo ni Kawe. Hatuna mpango wa kwenda zaidi ya Kawe. Na Kawe pale ndo tunasema sabini imeanza ya phase 1 imeshaisha na tutaenda kuanza phase 2 na tunaenda kumalizia ile miradi iliyokuwa imekwama. Lakini Kawe ile tunayojenga wakati tunaita leo iko kilomita tisa kutoka CBD ya sasa hivi actually nikikupa definition nzuri ya miaka mitano Kawe iko kilomita sifuri kutoka the new Dar es Salaam CBD kwa sababu kawe tunaenda tunai transform kuwa CBD. Huna jengo la chini, majengo yote ni high rise. Tunatamani kawe uwe ni mji kwa ajili tulivyopanga, uwe ni mji ambao utakuwa relevant for 50 years to come. Lakini tunatamani kawe uwe ni mji ambao utaoperate kwa masaa 20. Kwa ndio maana ukituliza vision yetu ya kawe, we have a very simple definition. We call it 50 20. 50 ndio vision yetu. Yaani kwamba master plan ya kawe ambayo itabaki relevant kwa miaka hamsini maana yake ukinunua property yako una uhakika ina appreciate constantly over the 50 years kwa sababu whatever is planned and whatever you bought is relevant for those for that particular period. Ya pili tunatamani mji ambao utaoperate at least for 20 hours a day. Uwe busy. Na kwa nini tunafikiri hivyo kwa sababu Dar es Salaam 60% ya GDP ina exchange hands in Dar es Salaam almost 60 to 70%. Asa if our city sleeps except our servants. Manake hatuendelei na hatuendelei haki Tanzania. Lakini lazima tujiandae kutengeneza CBD ambayo inakwenda tayari kupokea eh, LNG na opportunity zingine zote ambazo tunaziona. Kwa tunafikiri kwamba kwa hotels zitakazojengwa pale, kwa entertainment zitakazojengwa pale, kwa office blocks zinazojengwa pale, kwa um, uh, sports arena ambayo mheshimiwa rais ameizungumza, alizungumza, amecommit na tumewapa kiwanja this week na wanaenda kwanza ujenzi. Tunafikiri kwamba Kawe will be a very very active area. Kwa hiyo tunapojenga pale itakuwa ni zero kilomita to the CBD na huku mjini nako kutakuwa ni zero to two kilometers to the CBD. Wakati tunaendelea na kawe tutakuja kushambulia upanga. Tumeanza miradi ya ubia lakini sehemu ambayo hatukutangaza ubia ni upanga. Kwa sababu tunaenda kujenga na tutaanza kujenga ndani ya mwaka huu tunataka mtu akitoka ofisini pale akitoka nyumbani kwake atembee kwa mguu na laksati yake kwenda absa na atoke absa jioni arudi nyumbani. 
ikibidi aende kula lunch nyumbani because that's what we are looking for that's the quality of life kwa sababu apparently i'm told i'm told someone will announce soon but the heaven is also here so we must enjoy this heaven practice it before you go to enjoy the real heaven those who are not qualified they will not be allowed to spend the true heaven so kwa hiyo this is what we are trying little to make it up and we think we're going to succeed kwa the same way tutafanya dodoma the same way tunafanya mikoa mingine tunaenda kuimarisha maisha ya shopping malls na middle class lifestyle what you see in morocco few months down the line people will be sitting here and uh, thousands of people will be down here either in a movie theater or in food courts or in shops and the people will be in the hotel people will be in the offices and some people will be sleeping or cooking in the apartments Mama <laughs>